In the last part of the optimization tutorials we're going to talk about a feature that is specific for VR, which is optimizing VR packages. Continuing with the same 3D model that we used earlier, which you can access by going to the Academy, then to Scene Management, Optimization, and then double-clicking the first step. Go to the VR Viewer menu and select Show in Viewer. In the bottom right corner you will find the Settings button, click it to access the VR package settings. Here you will find the Optimize Package option. Optimize Package will merge all objects sharing the same material into one object, which in turn speeds up the experience and smooths it significantly, especially when your model has a large number of objects. Keep in mind that Optimize Package will affect static objects only, so if you have objects that has animation, scene states, or are part of any interaction they will be excluded from the process, and any interactions in VR will occur without any problems. Note that this option can also be utilized when exporting a VR package, and not only when viewing it. I'm going to talk about another optimization trick that is exclusive for VR, which is disabling cast shadow. If you have multiple lights in the scene and you find the experience to be slightly sluggish, you can disable the cast shadow option for some of the lights you're using. With the lights selected in the Objects tab to the right, click on Cast Shadow to disable it. Keep in mind that the Cast Shadow Toggle option is available for all the lights in SimLab Composer, and it only applies for VR experiences and not rendering.